Hey, you know, Cedar Point is best known for its thrill rides. While hundreds of thousands of visitors come for the coasters, they always stay late for the live shows. Including the Facebook friends. Channel 3 <laughs> reporter Dave Summers goes behind the scenes with the costume makers that help transport the actors and audience through time and space. To take a page out of Cedar Point Entertainment Manager Herbie Donald's design book... If it doesn't sparkle, it's not a costume. And it's not a show without Herbie Donald's designs. Herbie and his team of three full-time and two part-time seamstresses work night and day to create more than 150 individual costumes for the summer season. You kind of pat yourself on the back when, when people come up and go, I never realized that they could do this. The design team is tucked away in a small shop with no windows, surrounded by reams of fabric, costume pieces, and wigs. We try to give them a fantasy. The park features musical reviews plus the popular ice and country shows at the Centennial Theater. The Cedar Point shows use very few set changes, so the director keeps the audience interested with costume changes. So it's not enough just to be a talented actor, you have to be kind of a quick change artist. That's why when Herbie makes a costume, there's no real buttons or hooks. It's all Velcro and snaps. It's just as choreographed backstage as it is on stage. Donald says his costumes last five to six changes a show, five shows a day, for three months. I get people's measurements, and then I can design around them. In 22 years at the park, Herbie still considers himself back of the house. But his costumes design help bring the house down. In Sandusky, Dave Summers, Channel 3 News. Oh, that Dave Summers, you never know what he's going to do next. Donald is just as proud of his actors and actresses. Most are recruited from college campuses with greater ambitions. Some have gone on to Broadway and comedy clubs. Still thinking about Dave. One of his former performers recently won an award for his work in Australian opera.